Another unusually warm March day in Minnesota means the return early of these guys. Yeah, they're coming Ooh. back. Yes, the Mosquito Metropolitan Control District today unveiled their first forecast for the coming season. Richard Reeves spoke with the agency about what's expected in the coming months. Spring-like weather here early at Lake Baldwin in Lino Lakes, along with something else. There we are talking on your porch, and we see a mosquito. Yes, we did. We saw one about 15 minutes ago. For Suzette Dillon, that first mosquito sighting is a sign of what's to come, and a reminder of last year's lake flooding and those pesky headaches. You couldn't really stay out, you know, after the sun went down, because then they started coming out, you know. Pretty irritating. Huh? Yeah, it was. Right now, people are actually seeing some of those overwintering mosquitoes coming out looking for blood. Entomologist Diane Crane's job is to examine the little critters up close. At the Metropolitan Mosquito Control District Lab, we talked with her about what our recent warm and dry weather might mean. It just seems like we're not going to have a very large hatch of mosquitoes, but we never know because, you know. It's the weather, right? That, she says, could all change if we get a rainy spring and more water in wetlands. You know, swamps, shallow marshes, ponds that are pretty shallow and stuff like that, that's where you find the most mosquito larvae. The lab uses interactive maps like this to track known mosquito breeding hotspots, including Lake Baldwin. All around Lake, it looks like they have what we consider our red sites, which means they're highly productive mosquito habitat. Next month, the lab will start using a trio of drones, as well as helicopters, to drop pellets to kill mosquito larvae. The pellets contain a bacteria that interferes with the larvae's digestive system. Much of this, Crane says, is in the hands of the weather. We're trying to gauge if we have to staff up earlier or if we have to calibrate our helicopters for treatments earlier, we're just kind of looking at it day to day. Yeah, so a lot of this has to do with the weather. You know, we asked the lab how many wetland habitats are there in Minnesota where the mosquitoes can breathe. They said about 80,000. There are 52 different species. We asked how many mosquitoes are there in Minnesota. They told us it is literally in the trillions. Reporting live, Richard Reeve, 5 Eyewitness News.